Today we'll be installing the Titan Servo Hydraulic Brake Assembly, part number T2351000. With the trailer raised up, first thing we'll do is go ahead and remove the brake line going to the old brakes. Next we'll go ahead and remove the whole brake assembly. Before installing a new Titan assembly, we'll clean up the area, making sure it's clean behind it. Now I'll install a new Titan assembly. We'll go ahead and use some blue Loctite part number LT37484 around the bolts for added strength in connection with the nuts. Now we can go ahead and tighten the bolts down securely to our assembly. With that done, we can go ahead and reinstall the hub washers in the castle nut. Next, we'll go ahead and install the grease cap. Now, we'll go ahead to the back of assembly and then reinstall the brake line. Okay, with brake line reinstall, we'll have to go ahead and bleed the brakes out, which will consist of somebody activating the brake assembly and with the other person loosening up the valve behind the brake assembly. We'll have to do that several times until the fluid runs clear with no bubbles. Next, we'll go ahead and adjust the brakes. Using our brake adjusting tool, we'll go ahead and tighten up the brakes until the drum cannot be moved by hand anymore. Then we'll back off about 10 clicks. We should end up with a slight dragging of the brakes on the drum. We'll keep that equal on both sides of the axle, and that should finish it for our install. And there you have it for part number T2351000.